So about 10 years ago, uh, Dr. Tom Barstow and myself wrote a grant to NASA starting to look at what are the fitness and aerobic and health standards need to be for an astronaut to do activities on the moon, on Mars, in flight, and on landing. Part of that, we then had to build this capsule. And we basically came up with a way in which we could get a life-size replica made here in Kansas. It's a unique challenge that we have here, and there were obstacles along the way that uh, really took a team to develop. Failure's not an option. Yeah, Kansas allergies. You're rocking the allergies? Oh, rocking the allergies. I prefer to not use the LA okay. stuff. One reason that I think, you know, that we kind of said NASA likes working with Tom and I is that we can kind of think outside of the box and we can build this and do a lot of the work ourselves and reduce the cost that's going to be required that is if we said NASA make us one, we need it. You know, we can make one that will do the job and we can be under budget for doing it. And they like that. I think it's my punishment for not having classes this semester. I'm just trying to drill this one out that I stripped yesterday. We're close. Closer than we were six months ago. 